Hello, hello, hello. Good evening. Can you hear me? Good evening. Yes, hello. Hello. Good evening. Welcome. Good evening. Nice. Good Welcome. Hi. Happy Good Monday. Hi. Good evening. Good evening. Welcome. Thank you for being on time. Uh, nice to see you one more time. Let's wait for the rest. I guess people is uh, joining the meeting. So let's wait for the rest. Nice to see you. And uh, thank you for your cameras, for the ones that are with the camera already on. Let's see, let's see, let's see. See the attendance is right here. Nice, my goodness, still 12. Siempre 12. Me ha pegado la colcha hoy. Let's wait for the rest. Uh, Benjamin, nice to see you now that you are with the camera and full, full yeah. color. <laughs> nice. Let's see, Ana Patricia, Brenda, Isabel, Jacqueline. Liliana, Brenda, Adriana, Elisa, and Freddy. <clears throat> Freddy Jose. Janet, Jacqueline, it's coming. It is Janet as well. Nice, but still, my goodness, now we are 11. Alguien se salió. <laughs> Lejos de estar ingresando, se están saliendo. My goodness. ¿Qué les habrá pasado? Se les ha olvidado la clase. Y nos mandaron un mensaje. Quiero ver. Eh, recordando. ¿Dónde está el grupo? Aquí dice. ¿eh? A las seis. But anyway. So let me see. ¿Qué pasó con los demás? One more, we are 12 right now. So ya ingresó uno más. Make sure that you have two names and two last names in the app, please. Double check, two names and two last names. Well, let's start, okay? Uh, we are going to pass the attendance like in three more minutes, okay? probably more people will be joining the, the meeting, right? So let's see, um, Elisa, Areli, how are you today, Elisa? I am fine. Okay, you are fine. Okay, do you do something special today? Como? Did you do something special today? No, no entiendo. Did you si do... hiciste alguna cosa especial uh -huh. ahora. Uh, no, trabajar nada más. In English, in English. I work in, I work in the day. Okay, I was working during the day. So in past, right? I was working during the day, okay? So to complete the answer, right? Did you do something special during the day? Yes, I did. Pasado, me están preguntando con el did, respondo con el did, right? Yes, I did. I was working during the day, okay? So, o si la respuesta es no, no, I didn't, right? No, I didn't do anything special during the date. Uh, please make sure about your name. Tengo ahí a Galaxy, Galaxy Tab conectado. Make sure que está su nombre. Eh, Alison Celaya, le falta a second name and last name. Make sure que tienen ahí el, el nombre completo, please. And I guess, Elsie, that's you, Galaxy. Change the name, please. 
Creo que ha ingresado con otro dispositivo, no sé, Elsie, pero aparece Galaxy. Ok, make sure. Ok, so let's start with the um, attendance. Still, we have people missing. So it's Monday. I know it's kind of hard to start the week, right? Because it's Monday. It's not like uh, easy, but we have to. Ya sobrevivimos el día. Ya esto que nos falta, pues ya no es nada. Ok, so nice. Uh, paréntesis, antes de iniciar la asistencia, me pidieron ahí encarecidamente que hiciera el recordatorio del de trabajo de plataforma. Hace unos minutos, antes de iniciar um, acá la clase, revisé y sí, hay como unas tres, cuatro, cinco personas que no están completos. Tienen el 50% de la segunda unidad y hay como dos personas que tienen menos del 80% de la primera unidad. Y hay muchos que ya están en 100, 100, pero eh, tiene que ser todos, ¿verdad? Eso usted sabe que eso es bien importante que usted lo complete. Eh, Yo lo completé hasta el midterm. Excellent, very nice, ¿ok? Sí, vi varios que ya lo completaron e incluso van adelantados, pero como les digo... Solo, solo tengo las correcciones que... Que tengo que hacer sí. que le envíe solamente. Sí, ahí vi que está como en 50 en una sección, la otra sí ya la tiene. Entonces, eh, como les digo, esto, perdón que, 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 este, los insista tanto, pero es que a mí me, me mandan igual, así como les mandan a ustedes a, a cobrar el, la plataforma, a mí también me la mandan a cobrar, entonces eh, no esperemos que le llamen y mire fulano y sutano este, ¿por qué no ha ¿por qué no ha completado? Entonces eh, tratemos de ir al día, como les digo eh, si para mañana yo veo que hay un avance no voy a mencionar así los nombres, pero si yo mañana veo que aún hay personas así como que menos de, de, del, del requerido, al menos en las dos secciones, sí voy a mencionar acá lo, los nombres, ¿ok? Bien, so let me, let me pass the attendance. Still we have people missing, but anyway, uh, we have to pass the attendance. Igual al final se valida si alguien ingresa después, so no problem. So please uh, let me know if you are here, right? Uh, Monday the 23rd. So Alison Daniela? Present teacher. Nice. Eh, Ana Marisol? Present teacher. Thank you. Present. Ana Patricia? Present teacher. Nice. Barbara Alejandra? Present teacher. Nice. Eh, Benjamin Alejandro. I'm here. Nice. Brenda Adriana. Present teacher. Nice. Eh, Brian Steve. Here teacher. Nice. Eh, Brenda Isabel. Present teacher. Nice. Os Carlos William. Carlos William, no? Cesar Alexander. Present teacher. Thank you, Cesar. Um, let's see, Claudia Itzel. Claudia Itzel, no? Cristina America. Cristina, no? Eh, Daniela Magali Daniela, no My goodness eh, Edgar Fernando Edgar Fernando, no Elisa Arely Present Nice Elsie Patricia I am here, teacher Nice, Freddy Jose Present. Nice. Gabriela Maria. 
Gabriela, no. Eh, Griselda Lisette. Present teacher. Nice. Eh, Iris Janet. Present teacher. Nice. Ivania Stephanie. Ivania Stephanie. No. Jacqueline Liliana. Present call. Nice. Uh, Janet Jacqueline. Present teacher. Thank you. Janet Carolina. Present teacher. Nice. Jennifer Noemi. Jennifer Noemi, no. Okay. So we have the attendance. Just let me go back right here. Teacher. Hola, hola, Jennifer Noemi. I don't know if you say something. Present. Oh, okay, no problem. Okay, just give me one moment. I'm sorry. Okay, I'm sorry, I'm here. So let's just start. Uh, I don't know if you remember that we have like a kind of homework. I don't know if you did your homework. It was um, answer some questions, right? Let's see, I have something right here in the chat. Okay, so let's see. Uh, let me know if you can see the screen, please. I guess, yes. Yes, I see. Okay, yes, thank you, Freddie. Nice. So let's see, Freddie, number one. So question number one. I will ask you the question. You can give me the answer, okay? Uh, who's your favorite athlete and why? Uh, I don't have favorite athlete. Why? And because don't like the... Um, ¿Cómo se dice <laughs> el deporte? Okay, because I don't like sports, right? Because okay. I don't like sports. Okay. Because I don't like sports. Okay, nice. Uh, Freddy. Now, let's see. Freddy, choose one of your classmates and ask the second question, please, to somebody else. Okay. Uh, so, I think uh, that Gabriela is okay. here, right? Gabriela? Uh, yes, yeah, she is. You can hear me? Gabriela, where are you? She's if not, not choose somebody else, please. Okay. Uh, <laughs> I don't remember the, no the names of my classmates. Okay, but I don't know if you can see it in the screen. Okay, okay, okay. Let me see. Mm -hmm. Alison Daniela. Okay. Alison Daniela, you can hear me? Yes. Okay. Who are three famous uh, athletes in your country? Um, I don't know because I I don't like sports and I don't um I don't know anything famous athlete. Okay, I don't know. Okay, I don't know any famous athlete in my country. Athlete. Okay, athlete. That would be the, the correct pronunciation. 
Uh, well, nice. I don't even know. Who knows? Mm -hmm. A famous athlete in El Salvador. If Probably. Can... If can be... Uh, no sé, con... González, no. No. Mm -hmm. Podría ser. Yeah, I, I guess it, it could be like a um, um, <clears throat> soccer player. We do have some, like a couple of good players. Well, good soccer players. But I don't, I don't know the names exactly. <laughs> But no problem. Ma, eh, Mágico González? Yeah. Ah, yeah, he's the one. Uh, it's, it's not an athlete anymore, but it was, right? It was. Okay, nice. Uh, let's see, the next question. Ana Patricia, do you ever watch sports on TV and which ones? Do you... Do you ever watch sports on TV? Hmm, the third one right here, the third question. Do you ever watch sports on TV and which ones? Okay. I watch sometimes sports on TV. And I I to watch football, running and gym, gymnastic. Okay, okay, Ana Patricia, read one more time the first uh, sentence that you mentioned. The answer or the uh -huh. question? Yeah, the, the answer. answer. Mm -hmm. I watch sometimes sports uh -huh. on okay. TV. Okay, so what is, um, this is for everyone, right? So you have a, an adverb of frequency right there. Did you remember the position for the adverse of frequency? Que mencionamos dónde va el adverbio de frecuencia. I sometimes ah, watch. Very good. Very I good. sometimes watch sports on TV. Ajá, very nice. There you go. Ahí va el orden. Ya dijimos que tenemos que gramaticalmente ordenar las palabras, right? Okay. Very nice, Ana Patricia. Let's see. The next question will be for Janet Jacqueline. Uh, do you ever uh, watch sports live and which ones? I, mm, no, I never saw sports live. Mm -mm. Live, okay. Live, no. Do you ever watch sports? No, I don't, right? No, no I, I don't. don't. I don't ever watch sports live. Do you know what is live, right? Estamos bien ahí en live. What is the meaning of that? En vivo. Ah, there you go, en vivo, right? So which mm -hmm. ones? No ones, okay, no one. Uh, nice, uh, Brenda, it's a bell. Thank you, Janet. Brenda, it's a bell. Uh, what are two sports you don't like? What are two sports you don't like? Um, the two sports don't like are handball and basketball. Okay, so let's see, Brenda, Isabel, let's put it in order, okay? So I understand the answer, but we need to put the words in the correct place, okay? Read it one more time. Leala una vez más, Brenda, the answer. Um, the, the two sports don't like are handball and basketball. I'm sorry, I was on mute. Thank you. Yes, Brenda. So the correct uh, order will be the two sports I don't like are, okay, the two sports I don't like are 
Y ahí dice cuáles son, right? Ah, ok. So Alma that would be. And possible. Ok, very nice. Thank you. Let's see, the next one will be for uh, Benjamin. What sports or activities do you want to try? Any. I hate sports. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Okay, very simple question, but it's correct, right? I don't want to try any sport. I don't want to try any sport. Okay, very nice. Let's continue. Okay, let's do this. About favorite activities. So we are going to do this activity in groups. Okay. Um, Alguien tiene ahí el micrófono abierto. Deje ver. Ahí está. Thank you. Nice. It says write about your favorite activity. Include one activity that is false. Okay, so most of us right here, we say that we don't like sports, right? But we have to write something about any sport. So it says right here that we can mention false information. That means que podemos mentir. Usted diga que se levanta a las 4 de la mañana a hacer gimnasia y que después va a natación y que después regresa a clases de <laughs> básquetbol y que después hace running. Eso, right? So that would be the that would be the activity, right? So but we are going to do this um, in groups, right? So let me uh, create the groups, but let me let me take a screenshot right here for the just the example. So look, what we are going to do, we are going to write this um, little paragraph because it's like a small paragraph. And uh, you are going to share this uh, paragraph in the WhatsApp group, right? In el grupo van a ver que cinco integrantes, solo van a escribir uno. Okay, solo van a escribir un parrafito y ese parrafito uno de los del grupo ponen ahí lo mandan al grupo de WhatsApp, okay? So about sports, you can invent whatever you want. No necesariamente va a ser cierto, puede ser falso, pero la idea es utilizar adverbs of frequency, different subjects, different sports, okay? At least five lines, por lo menos unas cinco líneas. Ok, cuando ya tengan el parrafito bonito en cuatro minutos, tenemos que tener el parrafito. Uno de los del equipo dice, bueno, yo lo envío, le toma foto, lo transcribe, lo digita, como sea. Ok, and you will share that paragraph in the WhatsApp group. Ok, ahí en el grupo de WhatsApp me lo van a enviar. Ok, so, are we clear with the instruction? Yep. Yep. Okay, so we have four minutes, maximum five, okay? Maximum cinco minutitos y lo regreso acá al grupo principal. So you're gonna create the graph? The, the paragraph, yes, like at least five lines, por lo menos unas cinco líneas de parrafito, okay? About okay. sports, I will share with you the picture for the, um, the example. Let me see what is the group. Aquí está, someone is writing. Ok, ahí voy a mandar al grupo el ejemplo que está acá en el manual. Ok, just as an example. So, let's do it right now, ok.
Hola, teacher. Hey. Saturdays. Right. Enviado. Thank you. Perfect. Thank you. A ver si no se me fue alguna mal escrita.
Hello, 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 hello. Can you hear me? My goodness, what happened? Yes. I was waiting for the other yep. a paragraph. What happened? There is just one, the one that is with Patty Sanchez. And the rest, faltaron dos ahí. ¿Qué pasó? No lo lograron terminar. We already finished it. Ah, okay, sí, so please send it right there. So from the one that I'm it's there, send... thank you, nice. So el que han enviado ahí, Patty Sanchez Group, it says, I like to exercise every day. That would be, I like to do exercise every day. So el dates es no va en plural, right? Every day, it's every day. Uh, I begin walking in the morning three times a week. So, ahí no puede ir ING, ING. Ok, ahí tendríamos que poner I um, start, probably start walking in the morning three times a week. Si sí se pudiera hacer esa oración, pero ahí le tendríamos que agregar algo más. Sería una complex sentence, pero si una oración simple, no, no, no podemos unir dos INGs. Then I'm going to swim on Saturdays. It's okay. That will be future, but it's okay. I'm going to dance on Saturdays at night. It's okay. It's okay, say just Saturday night. Saturday at night. Está bien, pero uh, suena como domingos lo, porque lo queremos hacer como translative from Spanish, right? But it's okay. Thank you for the next uh, message. So we will see it later. So mándenme el otro que está pendiente y lo, 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 yo lo reviso después because of the time, right? So we need to take advantage of the time. So let's continue, okay? We have this conversation that it says, um, um, I am a real fitness freak, okay? Or am a real fitness freak. ¿Qué dijimos que era este fitness freak? ¿Quién recuerda? Un loco de, del, de, del ejercicio. Okay, como una persona obsesionada que solo pasa en el gimnasio, right? So, haciendo ahí los muscles. Nice. So, let's see. If this is a conversation between Ruth and Kate. Um, yeah, this is different, right? That's, yeah, this is different. So, it says, uh, you are in great shape, Kate. Um, thanks. I guess I'm a real fitness freak. Uh, how often, how often do you um work out? Uh, work out. Well, I do aerobics twice a week, and I play tennis every week. Tennis. That sounds a lot of fun. Oh, do you want to play? Uh, sometime. Mm, how well do you play? Pretty well, I guess. Uh, well, all right, but I'm not very good. No problem. I will give you a few, a few tips. Okay, nice. Uh, you already see Benjamin's group. Nice. Uh, very nice. So do we have new words right here? ¿Habrá alguna palabrita new for you? No? A few. Uh -huh, a few tips. Sí. Okay, few. This one, right? I will give you a few tips. Uh, te voy a dar un, un par de tips, okay? A few es poco. Few tips, okay? Como él le está diciendo que le va a decir tips de cómo hacer los sports, right? Ah, sorry. So that will be few. Okay, pocos. No more words. Nada más. New. Nada. 
Okay. So the let's. Cake. Sorry. Go ahead. Which which one, Freddy? Your English ship, Kate. Ah, Kate is that's the mm -hmm. name. Este es el nombre de él. Okay. okay. Kate. That would be él. Así se llama. Shape. You are in a great shape. Si yo le digo a alguien, hey, you are, you look great. You are, you are in a great shape. ¿Qué le estoy diciendo? Te ves bien. Te ves bien. En forma. Está en buena forma. En forma. Ajá, una persona bien atlética, así como que hace ejercicio. Usted mira y dice, qué cuerpazo, right? So that would be a good shape. Nice. Um, let's see. Uh, let's see, Brian, Steve, please be Kent. And Ana Marisol, please be Ruth. Go ahead. Mm -hmm. Brian, Steve, um, Ana Marisol. Okay. You are in great shape, kid. Thanks, I guess, and I really think that's Never. I don't know, but How I don't often know. do you work that out? Is? Well, I do aerobics twice a week, and I play tennis every week. Tennis? That sounds it's a light lot of fun. Oh. Do you want to play sometimes? Oh, how well do you play? Well, I guess. Well, all right. But I am not very good. No I'll give you a hint. Okay. Very nice. Thank you. So let's see uh, uh, right here. Uh, pretty well, right? Pretty well, I guessed. I guess right here. Um, what else? That sounds, we have a nest right here, right? Tiene que sonar esa S. That sounds like a lot of fan. Uh, then if it is a question, sounds like a question. Do you want to play sometime? En español no hacemos entonaciones prácticamente. Estamos haciendo una pregunta y es plano, como no con tono de pregunta. But in English, we need to, right? We need to do the intonation. Okay, so let's let's move on. Okay, let's move on. And we are going to stop right here. Questions with how, okay, and short answers. So you know that we have short answers and long answers, right? Normally the short ones are just yes or no. Una respuesta corta que solo dice yes, no, simple, right? But the later we will see the uh, complete answer. So let's see. Uh, questions with how, okay, how. Um, let's see. Jacqueline and Liliana, please read the first question and the three answers that we have right here, please. How, how often do you work up? Every day, tweaks a week, not very often. Okay, nice. So how often, right? As I told you, how often, how often, both are correct. So do you work out? How often do you work out? ¿Qué le está preguntando? ¿Qué tan a menudo hace ejercicio? No, ¿qué tan a menudo? Ah, ¿Qué tan a menudo se ejercita? No, ¿cuánto tiempo? ¿Qué frecuencia? Eh, Ajá, ¿con, ¿con, ¿con qué frecuencia? ¿Con qué frecuencia? ¿Qué? ¿Cada cuánto? Trabajo. Trabaja. 
No. How trabajo, work out? Trabajo. Es la primera, Baticha. Yeah, this one. Es Aquí cierto. Estamos. Ajá. Trabajo, creo. ¿Con qué frecuencia trabaja? ¿Pero ah. trabaja qué? ¿Con qué, qué frecuencia hace ejercicio? No, esa es la otra. No. Esa. Uh -huh. How often do you work out? ¿Con qué frecuencia, ¿Con qué frecuencia sale ejercicio? el trabajo? Ah, oh, que no es de oficina. ¿Con qué Ah, sí, sir, nice. Ok. Work out. Work out. Trabajo fuera. Como cuando dice, no, y me tocó trabajo de campo. ¿Qué quiere decir? Que no estuvo bajo las cuatro paredes y un techo de su oficina o de donde sea que trabaje sino que anduvo en la calle, o sea, trabajando, pero afuera. So that would be work out, okay? So how often do you work out? Oh, every day, twice a week, not very often. For example, salesman. Ah, salesperson, right? Él tiene que salir a vender, qué sé yo. Entonces, días en la tienda y a veces toca ir afuera a buscar a los clientes, right? So, ajá, there you go, work out. Nice. Let's see the next one. The next one will be for it. Um, vamos a ver a quién no le hemos preguntado. Alison, Daniela. So this one, how long do? How long do you spend at the gym? 30 minutes a day, two hours a week, about an hour all weekend. Okay, Alison, nice. How long do you spend at the gym? Okay, how long? What would be how long? ¿Cómo sería la traducción de la how long? ¿Cuánto tiempo? ¿Por cuánto tiempo? ¿Cuánto tiempo gastas? ¿Verdad? Pasa en, el, en, en el gimnasio. Pasa en, gimnasio. en palabras bien salvadoreñas, ¿verdad? Nosotros, hey, ¿cuánto tiempo pasamos en el gym, right? Ah, 30 minutes a day, two hours a week, or about an hour on weekends. Nice. The next one. Uh, let's see, Freddy, please. How will do you how will do you play tennis? With will about about average, not very well. Okay, Freddy, nice. How well do you play tennis? ¿Qué le está preguntando? How well do you play tennis? Que también juega. juega tenis. Very nice. Okay, así como que tanto puedes, right? How well, que tan bueno eres jugando tennis. Pretty well, okay? Pretty well. About average. Average. ¿Qué es eso de about average? Medio. Como más o menos, más o menos. Medio. así medio. en palabras bien nuestras, verdad? Más o menos, más o menos, ok. ¿Qué es el average? Si yo le digo su average es, es como un promedio, tipo. You go. Promedio. ok. Término medio sería aquí, verdad? Un juega promedio, o sea, no es de los que sobresale, pero. Tampoco de los que no puede, ¿verdad? Es un average, ¿ok? And not very well. So, nice. Elsie, Patricia, the last one. Elsie, Patricia, I mute. How, how good are you at the sport? Mm -hmm. ¿Qué tan bueno eres tú en los deportes? Okay, and the, the answers, please. Ah, uh, pretty good. Okay, not so good. Not so good. Not so good. Nice. How good are you at sports? Que tan bueno, right? Pretty good. Okay. Uh, not so good. Remember that these ones are short answers. Cuando usted me le hago una pregunta y usted me dice como uh, every every day. Ok, o sea, no es que esté malo, yo le entiendo y, y entiendo que usted me está comprendiendo lo que le estoy preguntando y da una respuesta así, escueta, o sea, simple, pero no es que Cortita. esté malo. Exacto, como cuando, por ejemplo, usted, es que eso, yo le pregunto, mira, ¿y qué ya comiste? Y usted solo como, uh -huh. 
sea, se entiende que sí, pero está dando una respuesta como así, como simple, right? So, but Importante. it's okay. Exacto, como que ya no, no quiere continuar la conversación. <risas> Exacto, right? So, but it's okay. I'm not saying that it's wrong. So, it's okay. It's a valid answer. But these ones are short answers, okay? So, ahora veamos una full answer. How often do you work out? I often go, uh, I often work at the office, okay? So, I often work at the office. So, Ahí ya viene una respuesta un poco más completa, right? So I often work at the office because of blah, 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 because of the weather, blah, blah. blah. So that will be full answers, but that will be something that we will see later on. So let's see if we have time. We have eight minutes. Complete these questions, then practice uh, with a partner. So let's do it right now. So let's see. Um, quizás vamos a dar unos dos minutitos para que las completemos, ¿ok? No sé si nos vamos a los grupos. Voy a tomar una captura aquí rápida para que eh, nos vayamos a los grupitos. El mismo grupito ya lo tengo armado acá. ¿Ok? So, ¿Qué vamos a hacer? Completar esas oraciones. ¿Ok? Ahí vea usted. Deje ver acá. Le voy a mandar la captura por si no tienen el manual ahí a la mano. Usted tiene respuesta. ¿Ok? Usted va a completar con el how, ok, ya sea uh, how often, how long, um, how well, how good, and so on and so on, right? So, estamos claros con la indicación, tenemos cuatro minutitos exactos, ok. How? Oh, ya terminó. Era how, how good, ¿verdad? How good are you? How good are you at volleyball? No, va. Bien, va. Sí, sí, está agregado ahí. How, how good are you at volleyball? ¿Qué te daría? La otra, la segunda. How long do you spend? La segunda sería ¿Cuánto how long? tiempo? How long? Uh -huh. Ajá, ¿cuánto tiempo el gas eh, pasa en línea? Desde que se hace las Ajá. mismas de la plataforma. Sí. Sí, las mismas son. Sí, son las mismas. La tres. La tres. Ahora en play. Ahora en play. 
say how, how often play cards once or do twice. you play cards? Do you play? Mm -hmm. En la cuarta, chicas, not very well, actually. La cuarta sería how well. How, how, how well. well do you know? uh -huh. Uh -huh. How well. Y esa no me la agarra en la plataforma, no sé por qué me marca el cosito. La cuatro de la o la tres. Uh -huh. La cuatro. La cuatro. Oh. Y la pongo así, how well do you. La cuatro, how, how well, well do you. you die? How well. Sería can you. Ah, thank Ajá. Eso Ajá. es lo que le falta en la plataforma. How well do you can. Es como, ¿qué tan, que tan bien puedes. Ajá. Type, que tan bien puedes escribir. Ah, ya, ya, ya. Ah, pero por eso no me agarra. Ajá. Hay cosas que cuesta adivinarlas ahí. Vaya, pero esas no las íbamos a escribir al grupo, no va. No, solo era... Creo que en el cuaderno quería que lo hiciera. Ah, sí, por si sí, no. ella pregunta. Ajá. Hello, 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 welcome, welcome back. Eh, quiero ver, faltan, ya están todos. Nice. Um, let's see. Nice. So time is over. Nice. Sé que entraron algunos eh, ya un poquito tarde. Necesito validar la asistencia. Pero antes que se vayan, eh, Paréntesis, hay que trabajar en la plataforma. El día de... Eh, ahora revisé y hay varios que no han completado. Este, Porfa, trabajemos en eso para que no nos vayan a estar ahí llamando la atención. Si tienen alguna duda, algún ejercicio que les esté dando problema me lo pueden enviar, ¿verdad? Me dicen qué número de ejercicio, el 1.8, qué sé yo, para poder ayudarle yo de manera más rápida, porque me dice, es que mire, ese no me sale, pero ¿cuál de todo? ¿Verdad? Son varios. Bien, eh, valido la asistencia rápidamente, ya son las nueve en punto, pero necesito eh, la asistencia. Voy a mencionar nada más los que no tienen asistencia, si no lo menciono a usted, es porque a usted sí ya le coloqué la asistencia del día. Déjenme ver por acá. Está eh, Carlos William. Carlos William no está. Eh, Claudia Itzel. Present, Miss. Nice. Cristina América. Cristina América no está. Daniela Magali, Daniela Magali, no, eh, Edgar Fernando, Gabriela María, Gabriela María, eh, Ivania Stephanie, Ivania Stephanie, Jennifer Noemi, Jennifer Noemi. Present teacher. Ok. So, permítame nada más le arreglo acá porque no le había puesto. So, then the rest. 
ya tienen asistencia. ¿Habrá alguien que no lo haya mencionado y no había entrado al inicio? Creo que no. Bien, so time is over. I'm sorry that I'm late. Two minutes de desvelo ya. Please, trabajemos en la plataforma, por favor. No esperen que nos estén ahí llamando por nombre. Avance ahí un poquito lo que usted pueda. Si tiene duda, me puede consultar. So we have class tomorrow. Toda la semana vaya Thank preparado. You, Thank you, Elsie. Vaya preparado que vamos hasta viernes, right? We have class night this coming Friday. So, thank you. Bye-bye. Okay, bye -bye. Bye -bye. Bye -bye. Thank you, teacher. Bye-bye. See you tomorrow. Bye-bye. Bye, teacher. Bye -bye. Bye -bye. Bye -bye. Bye -bye.